Hello everybody, I was brainstorming for some Christmassy type videos that I could make and I thought it would be fun to talk about some of my favorite Christmas slash holiday movies. I love movies, I always want to talk about them on my channel but I never feel like that kind of content fits in but then I remembered like I've pretty much put every kind of video on this channel so why not? I was going to make a video back in the fall season of my favorite fall movies to watch, but I was still questioning whether or not I wanted to put that kind of content on my channel, but you know what? Just fuck it. I'm doing it. I'm a huge movie fan. I at one point owned like four or five hundred DVDs, and those weren't even every movie that I ever really loved. It was just the movies that I had seen and could find. If I owned every single movie I've ever seen on DVD, I would probably have thousands. <laughs> I just, I love movies so much. So let's get on with the list. These are in no specific order because I am incapable of doing that kind of thing. I have like the strongest form of decision anxiety, so I cannot put things in like list order unless it's alphabetical. My first movie that I really love to watch around the holiday season is I'll Be Home for Christmas. It's one of those movies that I basically just grew up watching because that's what my mom like always had on the TV during Christmas and like it just became this super nostalgic like tradition that I just do every year. I just watch it every year because that's what I grew up doing. I love the story of it so much and like the lesson that is learned through the movie. Plus, it's responsible for my all-time favorite Christmas song by NSYNC. Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays is the best Christmas song ever. Next is The Holiday, which I know a lot of people don't like. My mom dislikes it a lot. And it's not necessarily a Christmas movie, but that's why I said also holiday movies. Because it's around the Christmas season. I'm not 100% sure if Christmas actually happens in the movie. I cannot remember off the top of my head. But I just love this movie so much, and I can't explain why. There's just something I love about it that feels really comfortable and wholesome. <laughs> I don't know, even though like there's cheating in it and all kinds of- and like death and stuff like that. I just love watching it and I just feel so- so, just so happy. Another of my favorite movies that is very, very old and I'm sure not many people even really know what it is these days. I'm sure older people do and like people my age. White Christmas is one of those like iconic Christmas movies that like I feel like so many other Christmas movies were influenced by White Christmas and if you've never seen White Christmas I highly recommend that you watch it. It may not be for everybody because it's set long ago, long long ago in a galaxy far far away. It's just such a good movie and I don't know if that's again nostalgia speaking because I've been watching that one since I was a very 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 tiny child probably since I was born actually another more recent movie that I really love to watch around the holidays is love actually and this one is quite an acquired taste I feel because there are some people who don't agree with certain things about the movie and then there are people who love it it's kind of like friends you know the people who love it love it unconditionally and the people who hate it think that the people who love it are just uncultured swine you know it's a good movie and there are good ideas behind it and it's fun to watch which is really all i want in a movie honestly i am not a giant movie critic by any means like if something entertains me i'm happy with it there are movies that i love that people hate or think are awful and i could not care less <laughs> it's just a fun easy movie to have on another iconic movie that i love during the holidays is home alone i love home alone one and two i like to pretend the other ones don't exist but I, I have seen the third one more times than I would also like to admit. I watch Home Alone many, many times during the Christmas season <laughs> because not only do I love it, my family also loves it. My mom and my dad will watch it pretty much any time it's on. They're watching it as I speak. I think they're watching the first uh, their second one now because they've already finished the first one. I just have always really loved both movies and I don't really think one is better than the other. I think they're both 
to be really fun and have a different story to tell, which makes them not really easily comparable to each other. Comparable. Comparable. But another iconic movie, I think, for the Christmas slash holiday season is The Grinch. And I am referring to the live action Grinch with Jim Carrey. I love The Grinch and I identify with The Grinch in many ways and I feel like in different phases of my life I relate to him in different ways which is just proof that it is a movie that is relevant on many different levels. I think it's a cool like message to send that the child is the one questioning like why we celebrate Christmas or like why we do the things we do around Christmas and have the adults be the ones that are like giddy children and have just this extra train of thought going on while also being a Christmas movie. I love things that have deeper meaning. Another very underrated movie that I love and I'm not sure exactly how many people have heard of it is This Christmas which has a bunch of amazing actors in it and the most amazing version of This Christmas by Chris Brown. A good soundtrack is like always a good way to pull me into a movie. If the music catches my attention, you got me. I'm there. I'm supporting it. <laughs> a really rare form of Christmas movie where it surrounds a, a, a family of non-white individuals <laughs> for once and how things are going in their family as far as the holidays and you know just the situation that they've got going on and how their family dynamic works and i think that made it much more of an interesting movie than if it was just a basic white family and i feel like it would have taken a lot of heart out of the movie if i'm being totally honest but it's an amazing movie and i cannot recommend it enough if you haven't seen it which i you know, I feel like a lot of people haven't. <laughs> I'm not sure how many people would consider The Santa Claus a classic holiday movie, but I do. I love all three of the movies. Uh, they're not all, you know, top tier, amazing, great movies, but like I said, I'm easy to please, so I love all three. <laughs> and, you know, it's maybe another nostalgia thing, uh, specifically for the first, like, one at least. I'm of the mind that Christmas movies don't have to be the most, like, amazing, award-winning, well-made type of movies. Like, Christmas movies can be as cheesy and as absurd as possible and still be really amazing and fun to watch, which The Santa Claus is. I feel like it's only fair that I include at least one animated movie. I can't remember exactly which one it is that I'm thinking of. It's either Mickey's Once Upon a Christmas or Mickey's Twice Upon a Christmas. It's one of those Mickey Mouse movies <laughs> and it's the one where Mickey and Minnie buy each other gifts but they had to sell something in order to get each other a gift so like she gets him a case for his harmonica but he had to sell his harmonica to buy her thing and then like she had to sell her thing. Yeah it's that kind of thing. I believe uh Scrooge McDuck has a storyline in it as well. It's been so many years since I watched it, but it's another one of those movies that I just always think about during the holidays, regardless of if I watch it or not. So I thought that I would include it. So that's pretty much all the movies that I'm going to talk about today. I feel like this is too long of a video and I need to stop rambling. I said pretty much the same thing about every movie. There are some I didn't include just because I don't consider them like like up there with my faves, you know, like Elf or Muppet Christmas Carol. Yeah, that's it for my favorite Christmas movies or holiday movies in general. Let me know what your favorite holiday movies are or just your favorite movies to watch during the winter if you're not somebody who really celebrates Christmas or you just don't like Christmas movies. That's totally fine and totally understandable because like I said, they can be extremely cheesy and ridiculous, which is not everybody's cup of tea. Thank you for watching. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.